Hi, I'm Shivan, serving as Le- Legal Internet Lexus and Law Company. Today, we'll discuss the overview of the Information Technology Act 2000. It is the first cyber law to be approved by the Indian Parliament. The Act defines the following as its object to provide legal recognition for transactions carried out by means of electronic data interchange and other means of electronic communication commonly referred to as electronic methods of communication and storage of information to facilitate electronic filing of documents with the government agencies and further to amend the Indian Penal Code, the Indian Evidence Act 1872 and the Bankers Book Evidence Act 1891 and the Reserve Bank of India Act 1934 and for matters connected therewith or incidental thereto. However, a cyber attack becomes dangerous along with the tendency of humans to misunderstand technology. Several amendments are being made to the resolution. It highlights the grievous penalties and sanctions that has been enacted by the Parliament of India as a means to protect the e-governance, e-banking and e-commerce sector. It is important to note that IT Act scope has now been broadened to include all the latest communication devices. The Act states that an acceptance of a contrary contract may be expressed electronically unless otherwise agreed and the same shall be have a legal validity and be enforceable. In addition, the Act is intended to achieve its objectives of promoting and developing an environment conducive to the implementation of electronic commerce. Thank you. And if there is any doubt, please mention that in the comment section.